Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to import the Google Street View into iCron 7.9 to make it become one of the sky or any of the 3D background in your iCron 7 3D animation software. So start from now, I'm going to show you step by step how to do this. You can see the Google Street View already have all the street view from all around the world for every street, even back streets. You can have the 360 degree panorama. So now how are we going to grab the Google Street View into Icon 7 to make it become the Icon Sky? <clears throat> so start from now, you can just go to my video description. Scroll down, go to your video descriptions. Now you, ha you have this link, download the Street View Grabber here. So once you already download the Street View Grabber, it will download it as a zip file. You have to extract it. After you extract it, you will get this folder, the Street, street View Grabber 1.60. Right. So this is the app. Next. Next, you, you have to go to the browser, the internet browser. For example, Google Chrome is one of it. Then go to the Street View, the Google Street View. Go and search the Google Street View. Or you can just search the Google Street View, Instant Street View, not this. You go to the maps.google.com. Or you can just direct type here maps.google.com. From the Google Map, it is easier to get the street view. So now I'm going to grab some of the street view. For example, in Singapore, let's have a look. Right now, let's say I, I go into any of the map. You can click into any of the streets. Now the internet a little bit slow here. I have to wait for a longer time. Right, for any of the street view, what you need to do is just click on the street. And then it will appear at the bottom Let's say if I click here, I click it. Then, if there, there's a street view here, it will show, show at the bottom. What you need to do is just click on that. Then it will enter the street view. Now this is the street view. Now it is still waiting, waiting for the street view to be loaded. Now this is the street view, right? So what you need to do is just go to the street street view grabber. This one, double click it, and then add the panel. But before that, you have to copy the street view. Just copy. Copy the URL link of the street view. This is the street view. Once you copy already, at here, the street view grabber, you, you click add panel. Do you want to import the URL from clipboard? Here you choose yes. And then untick the crop panorama. Then this is the quality that you can choose. Then you click grab. Once you click grab, just wait for a while. It is going to save the street view into the output folder. For this time, you have to wait until it finish at here. Just left a few seconds. The last moment. All right, now it come out of conversation. Grabbing process is finished. You click OK. Double click in the, the output. This is the street view. Right, this is exactly the street view that you want. And now, yep. 
close verse. And then in your icon 7, you can just go to here, just drag a simple sky, a random sky. Say for example this one to drag in. You will get a sky. Once you already can see the sky, you click here. You want to replace the sky's picture just by using the street view picture. Drag in. Replace it. The preview size here, you may just make it become bigger. Now you can see this is exactly the, the street view. Right here. Alright, this guy. You can just have a look. This is exactly the street views here. Right, so if, if I press home, go back to the scene, the prop, the shadow catcher, press F. Now you can see the street view already become, become the sky here. And you can see this is a discontinuity. In order to solve this problem, back to here, just double click the clear day. And by using this, you replace it again. Drag in. It can be better. For this discontinuity, this, this in order to solve this, you may just take crop the panorama. Then grab again. Later, you try to check it again. It should be this. Once you double click it, now you still can see some of the discontinuity here. If you choose the medium quality and take the crop again, then grab again. Okay, double click. Now you can see it already have the continuity. So if you, if you put the quality at here, it will have some errors. So the maximum quality, you better put it here so that it have the continuity. Which we go back to here again, then replace replace the texture again. Drag in. Alright, now you can see this is exactly the whole street view inside the icon. So now, go back to the shadow capture. You can see exactly this is the street view where you can put your 3D animation at here. It is really easy for you to operate. For example, you can just put a sim simple avatar here. Go to the content, the avatar. Here, the G5 character, for example. I want to have this girl. Alright, you can adjust the size so that you can make her to stand like just stand on the streets. Control, control G is to, to toggle. To toggle the grid line, All right? Of course, you can just just put her at the roadside. Then at the scene, if you go to the sky here, you can change it, change to any other street view again. All right. That's all for today about how to import the Google Street View to Icon 7.9 and make it become one of the 3D background. 3D panorama in your Icon 7.9 3D animation software. And that's all for today. Thank you for watching. If you love my video tutorial, if you feel all these tutorials are very helpful to your 3D animation and game developing, 
you can subscribe to my YouTube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all so that when next time I publish a new video tutorial, you receive a notification immediately. See you in my next video. Enjoy happy animation and game developing. See you.